Uh, we're looking great. I mean, we're all gelling as a unit. We're all um, getting our chemistry back together. Um, Coach Hope and Coach Brown are doing a great job of keeping us all, like I said, gelling together. So, I mean, as a group, totally, I think, cornerbacks and safeties and spurs, we're all looking good. So. DJ told us you were running the first team the other day. First of all, is that accurate? And second of all, what do you think you did to be able to get into that first team spot? Yes, I mean, it's accurate. And um, honestly, I've just been praying a lot, you know, working hard, coming out here every day. Um, just the opportunity. I mean, I'm trying to hold it now. But uh, just, like I said, the opportunity Coach Hill gave me, he threw me up with the ones. And right now, I'm just trying to hold it and be a leader for the guys uh, that are looking up to me and the guys that, you know, that I talk to a lot and just trying to keep my faith. So, so. What's been the biggest adjustment you've had to make since, since being out here on the practice field? Um, the biggest adjustment is probably just tempo, um, coming from a different tempo from the Big 12 to here. And then just, I mean, learning basically cover two, because, you know, uh, Kansas, we didn't really play a lot of two. We played a lot of quarters and cover four. So basically just um, getting used and familiar with the cover two schemes that Coach Hope is bringing back. So. And was it nice for you? To just get out here and start practicing because no matter how good you are, it has to be, you know, you have to be a little bit nervous when you're coming to a new place for the first time. Uh, yeah, I mean, I wasn't too nervous, you know, I'm not, I don't uh, bring a lot of nervousness to me, but I mean, it's cool to be out here. It's fun, it's exciting, you know, being around South Carolina, you know, it's a great school, great players, great coaches to be around and learn from. And every day I'm just taking it day by day, keeping my head high, keeping my faith, and, you know, just trying to stay positive as possible. So, And I guess has there, have there been any as as far as uh, have there been any uh, how different is the the way they play safety here as opposed to what you were doing in Kansas? Um, pretty much uh, basically the same techniques, kind of sort of you know I mean just with different coverages you know you have different techniques. Um, back there at quarters we had we played different uh, footwork techniques than here with cover two. Um, I mean just shuffles and steps. I mean but basically reading your keys. I mean reading two to one. It's basically all the same thing. It's just the really the, the Emphasis on the feet. It was a difference. So, and how do you feel about the secondary as a whole? I mean, you've had a, you've mm -hmm. had a, about ten days or so to mm -hmm. see what everybody can do. I feel great. I mean, you know, great group of guys. Like I said earlier, I'm learning from them and learning from me. And I mean, we all have the same goal. I mean, we all want to be a championship defense. You know, coaches harping it on us. So, I mean, we're just all trying to stay as positive as possible to lead this defense to greatness at the end of the season. So, and I know you uh, obviously you weren't here, but. Have you read much about, uh, you know, kind of uh, how people really aren't expecting a lot out of this defense? Uh, not really. You know, I don't really look into the media that much. I mean, I'm just really focused on myself and bettering myself and helping this team. I'm not really looking at internet and media and such and such. But, I mean, I know coming in, you know, I have the opportunity to help this defense reach the championship defense that we're looking forward to. So that's, some, that's what my goal is. I know that's what everybody else's goal is. So we're just out here working hard every day, trying to get this defense to where it needs to be. So. How good do you think this defense can be SEC-wise? I mean, it was top four kind of defense for a long time, then mm -hmm. last year was next to last in the SEC. I and mean, what kind of improvement do you think that can be made? Um, I think we have a great chance to be a great defense in SEC. You know, we, we have a great rushing cover. As Coach Hoke always says, you know, the better the rush, I mean, the easier opportunity is for the defensive backs and vice versa. You know, if we cover, then it's easier for the um, D-line to get there and get some sacks. So, I mean, overall, I think we're all doing a great job. We're all learning. We're all, you know, very studious as, uh, athletes, and we all just want to get better. And uh, our goal is to become a championship defense. So I think it's a good opportunity to get there. Who else is running with the ones with you back there in secondary? Um, Jordan Diggs right now, and uh, Rico, and um, Chris Lamont. Awesome. Mm -hmm. That's good. Rico and Lamont are cornerback. Yes, sir. Okay. Isaiah, is this where you expected? Did you expect it to be at a number one position? Is that one reason you came here? Is that um, something that was there for you? Yeah, I mean, sort of. I mean, I didn't come here, you know, to uh, really, not really say ride the bench, but, you know, I came here looking to help the SEMA any way possible. But, I mean, I'm just blessed and have the opportunity to become a one. So, I mean, I'm just trying to hold that spot now and just, like I said, be more of a vocal leader um, on and off the field and show these guys the right ways and, you know, just help this defense get to a championship defense and hopefully get this team to a national championship, so an SEC championship. So that's what we're looking forward to. The fact this is, this is the one one shot deal for you, mm -hmm. that that means your, your sense of urgency was pretty high when you when you when you got it. In fact, you got one shot to get this done, and then you're then you're out of here. Yeah, I mean, you know, I only got one season to play, so <laughs> I mean, yeah, I mean, but uh, most importantly, I'm trying to help the younger guys too, because you know yeah. they have they're gonna have a lot of time here too. So I'm trying to help them build, um, help them see how to do it the right way, and you know, just be a coach out there. You know, Coach Hogan's around, just tell them what they do. You know, just get on them.